One major House of the Dragon theory claims that Aemond is the father of his sister Helena's children, not her brother husband King Aegon Targaryen. Despite teenage Alice and Hightower's thought and saying that the Targaryens have queer customs, after hearing rumors that Rhaenyra slept with her uncle Daemon, Alice subsequently forced her own children into incestuous unions to strengthen the Greens' claim to the Iron Throne and escape a betrothal with Rhaenyra's son Jay Sayers. Alice and Wee Sayers' daughter Helena Targaryen was married to her brother Agoan. Following Agoan's coronation, Helena becomes queen with her twin children Jehera's and Jehera Targaryen being the heirs to the Iron Throne. However, if Aemon One-Eye Targaryen is the true father of Helena's son and daughter, not only would King Aegon's heirs be illegitimate, but the circumstances of the House of the Dragon's legitimacy struggle would also change. House of the Dragon Season 1 has surprisingly dropped subtle hints that Aemon and Helena's relationship is more than the typical brother-sister bond. In House of the Dragon Episode 7, young Aemond even snapped at Agoan for calling Helena weird and went as far as to suggest that he wished Alicent had made her marry him instead of Agoan. As adults, Aemond and Helena continue to interact in ways that seem to be teasing a romantic subplot. Some evidence comes from House of the Dragon Episode 8 when Jay Sears asks Helena to dance at dinner. While Agoan couldn't care less about Helena dancing, Aemon situates his chair to directly face Jace and his sister, looking more angry and stern than usual. More hints from Episode 9 when Aemon and Kristen Cole walked through King's Landing. The prince said he was next in line to the Iron Throne, whereas Agoan's son Jaehaerys is truly the heir. However, if Aemon is Jaehaerys' father, his statement is correct. Later on, Aemon steps in front of Helena when Rhaenys and Melis confront the Greens at Agoan's coronation. Considering that Aemon and Helena don't seem to have close relationships with other characters, their interactions could be interpreted as more than sibling affection. Beginning with House of the Dragon Episode 7, Agoan Targaryen expressed his feelings about marrying Helena. Aside from the fact that the two had little in common, Agoan was obsessed with the women of King's Landing and drank excessively. Helena, on the other hand, seems to dislike the idea of sleeping with Agawan. Aside from the dinner scene in which Helena claims Agawan ignores her until he's drunk and wants sex, House of the Dragon barely mentions the siblings' marriage. Since the Green Dragon Riders Helena and Agawan have been married for six years and have only been pregnant once, it's plausible that the few times they slept together never resulted in children. The most agonizing scene to come in House of the Dragon is known as Blood and Cheese, which shows the brutal murder of Helena's son Jaehaerys. There's already a video on this channel that explains this in detail, so click on the i button to watch it. While a son for a son was understood in George R. R. Martin's fire, and Blood Book is meaning Damon would kill Agawan's son for his allies killing Rhaenyra's son, it would be far more fitting if Jaehaerys was Aemon's child. Since it was Aemond who killed Lucerys, the revenge should have been on him, not Agoan who did not know about the event until after it occurred. As such, Blood and Cheese isn't technically a son for a son, but rather a nephew for a son, unless Aemond is Jehera's father. If Aemond truly is the father of Helena Targaryen's children, this would be the icing on the cake for the irony of the Civil War. One of the key reasons behind the Targaryen feud is that Rhaenyra's three sons are bastards, potentially costing them their claims to the Iron Throne. Alicent Hightower continually spoke ill of Rhaenyra for her affair with Harwin and tried to use the illegitimacy of her sons to ruin her reputation. As such, it would align with Alicent's demonstrated hypocrisy if her children were subject to an even worse love triangle. Considering him and continually taunted Lucerys and Jay Sayers for being strong bastards, the irony of his own children with Helena being bastards would be a brilliant development for the story. Not to mention that Agoan's children would have even less of a claim to the Iron Throne than Rhaenyra's heirs, as Jay Sayers is at least the true son of Queen Rhaenyra. So, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, please do us a favor, like the video, share it with others, and also subscribe to the channel because the bigger the channel gets, the better and faster the videos will come. Thanks for watching the video.